so the reason why I'm speaking right now um, and in, in, in any, any public domain is because I want a message to get out there and I have a voice and I can do that, that people need to change and people need to be kinder, whether that be in the press articles that are written and social media comments that are left on people's pages. It can ruin people's lives and we need to change as a society. And I'm speaking to you now because I want that to happen. My friend lost her, her life yesterday because of this. So well, what we think is because of this. I spoke to Caroline a few weeks ago when she was going through what she's going through. Uh, she's, she's got a, a court case coming up soon for a, for a personal incident that she had with her boyfriend. And I know that she's been really going through it in the press and on social media and people turning against her and surmising something has happened when nobody knows yet. So I sent her a message to say, I hope you're okay. I'm thinking of you and I'm here if you need me. And she wrote back to me and said, um, thank you, Mark. That means so much. Times are hard right now, but you know, hopefully there's better days ahead. Something on those lines. Caroline was up there with one of the most bubbly people I've ever met. If you're at a party, she was the first person to the dance floor and she just smiled from ear to ear. And I, I, I can't tell you how the stresses of social media and press and the way you, you, you know, people talk about others in public on, on public forums is so damaging. And I think we've seen this with Caroline because she, this didn't need to happen. This was this in my eyes, this was never, ever going to be Caroline's way to go. She was never going to do this. This has probably never been in her head. But what's happened, I believe, has driven her to this. Thank you for watching. If you want more extra, hit the subscribe button and the bell so you'll never miss a video.